What's up guys and welcome back to the hack spot in this video I'm going to be showing you guys my top 10 tweaks for iOS 9.3.3 and below now This is a long awaited list and this is my by far top 10 best tweaks. It's like the ultimate list I'm not going to be showing any boring or small tweaks I'm sure you guys will love all of these and with that said, let's go ahead and begin All right now this first tweak is called nude keys now I know what you guys are thinking but this tweak is actually really really cool so basically, if I go and bring down my keyboard, now as you guys can see, it has two colors. You can make it one color or two colors. You can do the top and bottom color. And just look how cool this looks. And here in the settings, uh, guys, I promise this is just a keyboard tweak. Okay, come on, believe me. So here you can do the top color of the keyboard and here the bottom color. And once you do, all right, so now let's go and swipe down. And there is our brand new keyboard. Just look at how cool this looks. Amazing tweak. Again, this one is called Nude Keys. Now, this next tweak is called Tether Me. So, on some carriers, if you go into settings, there's no option for personal hotspot right there. So, personal hotspot is completely gone. You do have to pay extra. I had this before when I was on Sprint. So, this tweak basically brings this feature so you can use it without actually paying. And if you guys don't know what a personal hotspot is, you can basically turn this on and then connect your laptop, your iPad, whatever you want to the internet of your iPhone. So you can use internet on your laptop no matter where you go as long as you have your iPhone. It's really a pretty cool tweak. Wi-Fi tethering completely free on any carrier. It's really a must-have tweak if a carrier charges for this personal hotspot option. Number three on the list is reveal menu. Now, yes, this is an iPhone 6S, but if you have an iPhone 6 or any other older device and you do want this 3D touch right here where you basically press down harder on an icon and this pops right here so you have shortcuts, you can bring this to older devices. So if I was still using the iPhone 6, this would be a must-have tweak. So with reveal menu, installed you can basically short hold on an icon in order to bring it up so you don't have to tap on a hard just short hold and this menu will pop up just like on the iphone 6s it's really pretty cool there's more to it right you guys can see right here but that's the basic of what it does so if you want 3d touch on an older device install the tweak reveal menu number four on the list is a tweak called power tap again i really really admire this tweak love it so basically if you hold on your power button it will bring up that same menu right here, bam. But right now, as you guys can see, it says slide to power off. But if I go to tap on this part right here once, it says slide to reboot. I guess tap on it again, slide to respring. Tap on it again, it will bring us into safe mode. And tap on it once again, and you'll be back to slide to power off. It's really pretty cool, and I really do love this tweak as well. Very, very handy. Again, it is called power tap. Number five, cylinder. Now, this is another must-have tweak if you like animations. Look at this. How cool does it look? I really love this tweak. It's an OG tweak, but it's still one of the best. I mean, look how cool it looks. In the settings here, you can use a bunch of different effects and even combine them. Now, in order to randomize, you do have to have some selected. So, as I can see, I did select a bunch. Let's go select some more. All right, cool. So, now let's head back. This is the fun part. All right, so there you go. Look at all the different animations. So, again, there's so many that you guys could choose from. Wow, look at this. It looks, looks super trippy. Super trippy. Okay, let's see. Okay, what page am I on? Again, this tweak is called Cylinder. This next tweak is called CC Background. Now, look at my control center. My god, is it boring. With this tweak, let's go into Settings, CC Background, Enable it. Let's go and select an image. All right, so I selected my image. I don't want to show you guys my image, but you guys will see over here. Okay. All right, three, two, one, bam. Okay, look how cool that looks. We got Ash Ketchum in our control center. This is probably not the best wallpaper, but you can choose any picture that you want. Oh, thanks for following me. Okay, guys, but sadly, I do have to use this as my control center picture because hashtag Boogle has taken over. But again, this is a really cool tweak. Again, it's called CC Background. This next tweak is called Zeppelin. Now, if you're an OG jailbreaker, you guys know this tweak. It has been here for quite a while, but it's still one of my favorites. So yeah, Boogle noticed this on my phone. He saw the Batman icon. He's like, what's up with that? I'm like, I don't know. So here in the settings of Zeppelin, you can change your carrier logo to whatever you want. So again, there's a bunch right here. You can even download separate packs in Cydia. There's so many packs. There's like Pokemon packs. You can have like a Pokemon in the top left. I don't have the pack downloaded, but you guys can do that. But it says each is tapping on one and it will change. So there you go. Look at that. Boom, boom, boom. It's kind of glitching out. Let's keep it at Pac-Man. Okay, where did Pac-Man go? Pac-Man. All right, so it does take a little bit of time to take effect, but check that out. This looks so much better than a T-Mobile logo. Again, this tweak is called Zeppelin. Tweak number eight is called iWidget. Now, this tweak is really cool. Basically, I have to put widgets on your iOS-based device. So here, where I have a blank space, I'm going to go ahead and tap and hold, and it'll bring up this menu. So here, I have some widgets that I have installed. So if I go and tap on 3D Sonic, I go and tap on Add, and there he is. Now, to move him, I can go and put my apps in wiggle mode just by tapping and holding, and now I can move him around. 
just like this put them anywhere on my device and then press on your home button just look at how cool that looks it's really pretty cool and you can actually also get some functionality out of this so if you go up and open up Cydia, you can install some packs so if you go to type in i widget there's some packs that guys can download so this i widget pack one pack two there's a bunch of different packs that guys could download there's a triforce i could get or just make your device look cool so you can download a weather widget a time widget there are so many widgets that are available inside Cydia. if you want sonic or even the hulk you can go ahead and just type in animated and there's animated second sonic 3d i downloaded that one there's animated hulk right there let me go ahead and show you guys what this looks like all right so again tap and hold on an empty space and there's animated hulk now i'm gonna go ahead and add him and there he is look at him a beast so i'm gonna go ahead and move him let's go move him down over here uh, he's too big but <laughs> okay he's blocking out city but again you could add weather widgets time widgets this tweak is very very cool you can put them anywhere on your device and just give your device a whole new look and feel number nine is a tweak called display recorder so here on my device i have downloaded display recorder if i go and tap on the app that it brings here it is now let's go and tap on this button right here to start recording and hit record and there you go now it's recording now the cool thing about display recorder is it does not put a red banner at the top right there pretty awesome tweak and it does run really smooth as i can see even with the screen recording and you want to stop recording just go to tap on this tap on stop recording this will allow you to record gameplays as well and there you go recording complete hit ok and if i go to tap on it from here i can delete it share it rename it play it or add it to my camera roll so i can export the video too which is really cool so you can record gameplays and this is what it looks like here on the side and while i'm showing you guys that i'm also going to go to settings if you want to record your audio tap on video format and then tap on h.264 with mic audio and once you do that then it'll record your audio through your mic on your phone also you can choose a rotation so if you're playing a game that's like this you choose landscape left or right and you guys get the whole deal right here so overall a very cool tweak for recording your device's screen again this one is called display recorder number 10 is a tweak called harbor now this is a very very nice tweak so take a look at my dock instead of having just four icons i can have as many as i want and just like on a mac you can enable magnification so it kind of bounces around like this it's like a wave it's a very very cool tweak and if you go ahead and let go on one when you're going like this it will go and open it up so just like this you can go ahead and let go and boom pretty neat little tweak again you can just add as many icons as you want right there just like this and boom if you want a bigger dock and just want to give a mac os x feel to it harbor is a must-have tweak all right so that brings us to the end of this video as always i really do hope you guys enjoyed but there are of course many more tweaks that i do want to share with you guys if you do want a part two please leave a like on this video and i'll share with you guys some more awesome and amazing tweaks there's really so much you could do with the jailbreak it's incredible my name is the hack spot i'll catch you guys real soon in my next video peace out Oh.